Hi artists, um, I'm Dr. Montserrat Andres and I am here at the Festival Flamenco in Albuquerque and I'll be running a med clinic during the week but I'm here at Walgreens which is just two blocks away from um, the dance center at the festival um, with some things that I think would be really helpful for you during the week. So here for example are some toe spacers. So if you're having um, any of your toes are rubbing together or if you're starting to get any pain in your big toe You can come get some toe spacers put it in between their gel So they're really really squishy. They won't add a lot of bulk, but they'll keep your toes separated and the joints from hurting as much um, This is moleskin. So if you're getting any blisters You can use the moleskin over that patch that's getting kind of red and irritated if you already have a blister pop it and then put the moleskin over it. You want to leave about an inch on either side of the area that's irritated and it'll actually stay in place for most of the week. So cut a really big patch of moleskin, stick it on there and it'll actually, because the moleskin is a felt, it won't stick to your shoe like a regular band-aid will. It'll actually allow you to glide through even if you're sweaty. Um, and then here, this is a ball of foot pads. So there's some people that have their second toe that's longer than the first toe. And if you see that, a lot of times people will build a callus there. And when you start dancing a lot, if you hit there, it can be painful. So if you take one of these foot pads, you can cut a hole out in that spot the where in the you have extra department. pressure. And then that will actually keep you from um, hitting that area so hard and it'll Customer hold a lot better. Back, please. Um, back. Sorry, we have a Thank lot of... You. No, it's happening. But here is some arnica gel. If you have achy, sore muscles for your feet, um, for your back, for your arms, anything, this is the regular one that I get. But I just realized they have a new roll-on, so that could be kind of cool for you. Um, and then the last thing, I got this in the toy section. Um, it's just kind of, it's a little bit of a softer ball. It's not like a regular baseball, even though it looks like it. It's a little bit squishy and you can use this to roll your feet out at the end of the night or you can use it to roll any of the muscles. Um, you can look at some of the previous videos that I have on how to use balls like this to do some soft tissue work on yourself. So I hope this is how Hi, flamencos. So these stretches are gonna be for people that are having pain in their hands and their forearms. So playing the guitar, castanets, or doing a lot of floreo. So you can start with the ball and just roll the ball on the palm of your hand. Look for any sore spots and just hang out and spend extra time there. If your forearms are feeling achy, you can lean on the ball and you can either just rest on the spot that hurts or you can be moving it around. If you turn your palm up, then you get the other muscles there. And just spend time wherever it's feeling sore. Um, a stretch for your forearms is to point your fingers back towards you and then rest your hand. If you're feeling like that's too much pressure, you can place a towel underneath your wrist to lift it a little bit to make it more possible. Um, if you then keep your fingers pointing towards you and then here, make sure that your elbow faces forward, you'll be able to stretch the top part of your forearm. All right, festival dancers, let's do some work for your feet. So these are gonna be some stretches. Go ahead and start with each toe going forward and back. You can push it, pull it. Spend time on any one toe that needs more attention. Then cup your hands around and we're gonna be moving up and down. Go ahead and start moving the bones of your foot forward and back. Again, any spots that feel tender, spend more time. And then the last thing will be to bring your fingers in between each of your toes to spread them. Hold it there to get a nice stretch. Or you can start twisting in either direction to get some movement into your arches and into that front part of your foot. All right, stay healthy for the rest of the festivals. So if you have been singing, playing guitar, or dancing, and you have any soreness in your upper or mid back, this is for you. So if you have a foam roller, go ahead and lay on that. You can start by just letting your body drape over, then go down a little bit, drape over, go down a little bit more, and drape over. If you're feeling warmer, then you can start rolling forward and back 
onto those tight areas in your back. Then you can push the foam roller aside, lay face up with both hands on the floor, cross your legs and let your knees fall over to the side. Take a few deep breaths there, then come on over, cross in the other direction and let your hips go the opposite direction. That will help stretch this lower part of your back. Hi, Flamencos, congratulations, you made it through workshops. Um, so now I have a couple of things that you can do to um, decrease some of the pain in your feet. So I'm gonna show you a few exercises. Here, you can roll your foot on a lacrosse ball. So usually I'll start here and just work the front part of my foot and then roll on to any areas that feel particularly tight and tender. Then you can stretch the top parts of your toes. You can hold there or you can kind of pulse through. And then lastly, spread your toes and stretch your calf by bringing your knee over your toes, but making sure that your heel does not lift and you can pulse through.